everyone. I would like to just share a bit of this information that will uh, continue into the mark. Um, yeah, so satanic prayers in the Bible. Well, you should not trust others to interpret this book for you. The Bible was not considered the word of God by the ch early church. The pe and the church are the people, by the way. The Bible is so complex for a novice priest to comprehend that the church leaders simply forbid their lesser ranks to even own a copy. And the people of, of the church that went in didn't own copies. You know. Why? The secrets of its all meaning are well buried. The theological astute to know where to find the answers, but most of them are Freemasons, and would rather keep this knowledge secret. But this is a fat movement, and there are no secrets here. These passages are found in just about all Catholic Bibles, but for some reasons the canticles are not just not found in the Protestant Bibles. Could the following passages be why all Protestant King James Version Bibles conveniently excluded the books like Canical Av Canals from the original Vulgate? If you have been noticing a trend, the answer should be obvious to you. This is why God the Mother mother's third secret of Fatima threatens Rome's destruction because of the dogma has not been preserved. The Vatican II priesthood post-1959 bases everything in the Bible, hoping their followers won't notice. Remember, scholar scripture, or faith by scripture alone, was the doctrine of the Calvin and Luther, both heretics to the church, both as a result of Vatican II. The Bible is the Vatican's religion. Remember the Catholic uh, remember the church used to have its own books, rites, and mass had nothing to do with the Bible, and this is for good reason. In the future, this Fatna movement chapter will become a depository for shocking things in the Bible, the book written by Freemasonry to subvert the Roman Catholicism. Enjoy and spread the word in the link. So, Solomon's Canticle can Canals, describing Baphomet, 1610 Reese, um, not in Protestant Bibles, 309 King Solomon, 666 identified in 3 Kings 10, 12, 14, he hath made a portable throne of wood of Linebus, 310, the pillars thereof have made uh, silver, the seed of gold, the going of up of purple, and purple is a sign of um, royalty or elite, the middles he hath paved with charities for the daughter of Israel. 3.11. Go forth, ye daughters of Sion, and see King Solomon in the diadem, wherever, wherewith his mother had not crowned him in the day of his disposing, and the day of joy in his heart. 4.01. How beautiful, thou my love, how beautiful art thou. Thy eyes it were as doves beside that which he hideth within. Thy ears as flocks of goats which have come up from Mount Gilead. 402, the teeth as flocks of them that are shown, which have come up from the lavatory sewer. Al with twins, they're among, and there is no barren among them. 403, the lips are a scarlet lace, and thy sweet speech sweet as a piece of promulgate. Uh, also thy cheeks, so which they, which lilled is within. 404, the neck is a, the Tower of David, which is built with bulk works, a thousand targets hanging on it, all of the armour of the balance. 405, the two, thy two beasts as two fawns, the twins of Roe, which feeding among the lilies, crop lips 5.9, and they sung a new cantonel, saying, Thou art worthy of the Lord, the mine of the Latin vague, vulgate to take the book, and to open up the seals thereof, because thou wastest thy name, and hast redeemed us to God, and of us, and thy blood out of every tribe and tongue of people and nation. So, thy hearers, ears, as the flocks of goats, thy teeth, as flocks of them that come, that are sworn, which have come up from the lavatory sewer. Thy speak sweet, thy neck is of the Tower of Dabel, they two breasts as the two fawns and the twins of the row which feed among the lilies. So you can see in the 1966 Catholic Revised Bible, the 1990s Masonic 
uh, King Version Master Reference Holy Bible. Note how they're trying to hide um, this by writing three score instead of sixty. This stunning link between Solomon and Haram six 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 of Freemasonry is clear. So six hundred three score six tons of gold. 666 tons of gold. So, 1685 Catholic Latin baguette. Um, 666 tons of gold. 1699 Dorian Hebrew Greek translation, and it's most interesting is that after the execution of the Dois Reims priest who put out the 1592 new translation of the 1699 Old Testament. Released a generation later, uses the term Our Lord. This consists with the raging war between the English government planting their own Masonic traitors in dowry to prevent an accurate translation. It doesn't really matter which version of the Bible you use to learn. Um, you use to learn that the Lord is Satan. All the Bible versions are satanic in nature. Originally, penned by the Jews who murdered God on the cross, all Bible versions purposely deny the divinity of the Catholic Trinity, which is required knowledge to enter the doors of heaven. All Bible version leaders lead their believers to God of the gates of hell, a deceiving three kings to two. Um, Jealous, Jeremy 4, 24, Preserved Spirit, Isaiah 19:14, who speaks through a burning bush fire, Hebrews 12:29, from a house which is adorned with 666 talents of gold, 1 Kings 10, 12, 14. So, to avoid getting caught up with this nonsense and avoid going to hell at the very least, please stop attending the religious service to Satan's. Below are some quick passages to help you awaken this to this apocalyptic deception. And I can't attend a church. When I walk into, like, a church, I feel negative and, and the eyes, when they look at you, I, and they come up and they're like, oh, you know, how, are you, how are you? And they're all nice to your face. And as soon as you walk away, they're running you down. I know. I, I just can't stand it. So, hell and destruction are before the Lord, Proverbs 15.11, and Solomon wrote Proverbs uh, because the Lord thy God, Satan, is a consuming fire, a jealous God. Woe to you that desire the day of the Lord. To what end is it for you? The day of the Lord is darkness and not light. Amos 5, 18, 19. For our God is a consuming fire. Hebrews twelve twenty nine. Explain the fire, Lord of the Jews. Bible. The Lord will deliver him in the evil day. Psalms 42. And Psalms was written by Solomon as well. And he said, I will go forth and be a lying spirit in the mouth of all these prophets. And the Lord said, Thou shalt deceive him, and shall pervert, go forth and do so. 3 Kings 22.22 22. And the Lord said, Thou shalt deceive, and shall pervert, go out and do so. 2 Pampelonium 18.21 The Lord has mingled a perverse spirit in her midst. Isaiah 19.14 And the king made a mugwood supports for the house of the Lord and the king's house, lyres also, harps for the singers. Now the weight of gold that come to Solomon in one year was 666 talents of gold, 1 Kings 10, 12, 14. So I just wanted to share this one, you know, some parts of the Bible uh, do, do have truths in it, but it's it's been corrupted by man, and it's it's corrupted big time. So... Yeah, don't, you know, tack me over. I'm just trying to share a message. So, thanks for watching. Bye.